Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to this afternoon's Proverbs with Paul in the afternoon, uh, chapter 2, and we're looking at verse 9. And uh, Solomon says these words. Then you will discern righteousness and justice and equity and every kind of good course. So then you will discern. So having stayed on the path of righteousness, Solomon says, you will then discern. Wisdom is saying, having stayed there, you will discern. Meaning once you've learned how to be steadfast, you will be able to discern. And discerning is the ability to really see and perceive the spirit of the way forward. The sense of who is operating or rather what is operating in this moment. Is it something wholesome and rich and good and lovely? Or is it hostile and dark and offensive and evil? Will it create problems or will it bring about a solution? And every situation has that sense of what's the spirit of this moment? What's taking place here that needs to be resolved? What needs to be, as it were, um, made peaceful in the turmoil of this moment? And Solomon says, if you stay on the road, then you will discern, as it were, the righteous way forward. And you will, as it were, operate in justice. So you will make a just insight into what you're facing, no matter what it is. And as you learn to discern, that means to stay firm, fixed on understanding what is the spirit working in this situation. Solomon says you will then be able to exercise righteous judgment. And uh, he goes on and says, uh, equity in every kind of good course. Equity really is the ability to judge fair, to make a fair judgment, a fair assessment, and come up with a righteous conclusion that will bring about the best pathway to tread, even in this situation. Whether the situation is a small thing or a large thing, he says, if you learn to stay on the path, listen to the wisdom that's being brought to you, you will be able to make a fair judgment and therefore exercise the right course of action to take. And of course, to not stay on the path is to, in effect, position yourself so that you don't make a fair judgment, that you get caught up in the very moment that you're trying to bring a resolve to. And that will bring disaster to everyone. Have a great afternoon. Be blessed. Enjoy the sunshine. It never rained. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you tomorrow.